Now you see Zauerbach breaking Krasinski down as we're going. He's starting to land more and more, a little more consistently, but again, it's only one or two good shots around. He lands the jab first, and then the left hand comes behind it. Because you, you've got to be, able, you know, you got to get that bead yeah. on a guy like that. Yeah, he set that measurement too, yeah. especially where we figure out where he's going, where, he, where he's going to be. I'm surprised if Shashinsky has won a single round in this fight. I would be surprised if he tries to win a single round in this fight. Yeah, busy but not exactly effective. I think if he stands his ground, he's going to get knocked out. So, yeah, and he knows that too. Yeah. which is why I think he's he's content with. It. Just going the distance and not trying to win the fight or the rounds. Yeah, we're just seeing the power. He's feeling it, gentlemen. And then also, if he maintains his ground, it's also those sneaky body shots get in there too. Mm -hmm. and, that, and that's where Zauerbeck, you know, can surprise you. It's funny to see, Chris, you pointed it out, man, after those body shots, he went from fifth gear to third gear. Yeah. I mean, it's just slowed him down. It's That's how he has responded to those body shots. It's the one way to, to, to slow down a mover. This has been the most active offensively that Shashinsky's yeah. been all night right here. He just, you know, this first minute of round nine here, he threw a ton of punches. Yeah, it might prove me wrong. He might try to win this round. <laughs> it's like they hear us, Paulie. I insult him a little bit, so. Yeah, we, 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 we insulted him. You're, that, you're that, a little, little out on yourself. We a little out on yourself. We definitely insulted that, that seven. We definitely <laughs> insulted him because, you know, we said that he wasn't going to make it this far because he's 37 and activity, but uh, he's kept up. He's kept up. This man is in, in fantastic shape. Zabak opened up late in round number eight. He started a little bit earlier in round number nine. That's my question. Ooh. Oh, look at that shot. Gotta be careful with those head clashes, man. Good shot with the right hand, yep. To your point, he seems a little bit more willing to risk those head clashes to get inside to land big punches. Well, you know, he knows he can hurt him. He's, yeah. he's hurt him. Oh, oh nice hook. right hook. Zarbach having a lot of success with that lead right hand from the southpaw stance. When you're in the barbecue, mm -hmm. he's swatting it away, but he, he just moves around with the wind. I know we're running out of time, but I really do feel like Zauerbach has an opportunity to get the stoppage still. Question is, will he put his foot on the gas to do it in a fight that he has well in hand? I think he's trying to put his foot on the gas. It's just, again, again, I think it's just a matter of tracking down Trzinski. But Trzinski's definitely not moving as much. Well, he's not on his legs in this round the way he's been. And he's eating more power punches because of it. And it's one thing, when you train to move, but you have to stand and punch, yeah. you get way more tired. If you're training to punch you and you're forced to move, you get way more tired. It's what you're used to doing. I, I think he's much more of a mover than a puncher, so we'll see how he reacts in the next round. See some replays of it. Yeah, and the, the best round so far for Shazinski, but also a very good round for Zauerbach because he was able to do some damage and put some put some leather on the savvy Polish fighter. Here we see that early round, that first minute where Shazinski was really busy letting those hands go, especially the right hand. There's a big looping shot which missed, but Zauerbach comes back with authority, landing big shots. And again, Jimmy, to your point, it knocks him off position so badly that it's, it, you can't not score these rounds when you get a guy who gets hit and flies halfway across the ring. Sultan Zarbeck in the red and gold. Damon Shashinsky from Poland in the white. As we said, probably has the fight well in hand on the scorecards. I got him winning every round. Yeah. This, this could be a shutout. I'm trying to track down Shashinsky again. One of the reasons he has, has no leverage on his shots is because his feet are off the ground when he's punching, too. I mean, he's moving as he's punching. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, he looks physically strong, but I think, he, again, like, you're, to your point, doesn't sit on yeah, his yeah. feet are never on the on the mat. I don't care how strong you are. You can't punch hard like he's that. Just Unless you're Manny Pack. Excuse me. Because Manny didn't even need his feet. Oh, oh! Big left hand! First knockdown of the fight! Jamie made a good observation later on. He said, you know, can it still be a stoppage? Let's see. Can... Zab be the first to stop Przezinski in this round. You got two minutes. Yeah, because the, the feet were just not the same from Przezinski, and, and you know the amount of punishment that Zauerbach has been able to put on these last few rounds is still very possible. Also, the rush these referees tonight have been in to get out of the ring when they can see it's an opportunity to stop a fight. Zauerbach now turning it on. Finally, has Przezinski. I won't say cornered, but certainly moving back. Not that lateral movement that has allowed him to avoid punches so far in this fight. Yeah, that flighty movement yeah. is not there anymore. You know, he, he lost it in the last round. He took a lot of damage that round. Here we see Zauerbach trying to finish. 
Should Jarba get that to the body when he gets close, guys? Yeah, absolutely. But Shijinsky, he fires back, Chris. We've been pointing this out. He doesn't just run. He's, no. When no. he's hurt is when he actually throws. Yes, when he's not moving, he throws, and he throws with authority. Again, I think he's a very strong guy, even though he doesn't have a lot of knockouts, and he's very flighty. Because he gets he gets a respect when he throws. When he's on, when he's not moving and he and he stands his ground, he actually gets respect. So you can tell he's got he's got some pop. A minute Charles to go here. Posing himself here. One minute left in the final round. It has been a, a technical wipeout. Because he for cut too. Back. Yeah. Cut. cut. I think it's in the middle of his forehead. His face is definitely getting busted up. Zarabak still being defensively sound, though. He's coming in, but he's moving his head. He's trying to get Krzyzynski to make some more mistakes. Krzyzynski is in full defensive mode at this point. We can never describe the fighter from Kazakhstan as reckless. Yeah, Krzyzynski, he's throwing, he's throwing keep off me punches. Shut out with, with a knockdown. Not bad, but it, did, it definitely... Krzyzynski did his job. <laughs> nice defense for that big thing. Yeah, Krzyzynski got the job to go the rounds. He did his job. He made he made him look bad at spot at times. Made him look a little not spectacular and makes it to the end. Both guys are content to dance away the last few seconds. Uh, better version of him as well. Yeah, right there. We're gonna take, we're gonna check out that knockdown from the tenth round. I love that that frame that he does with that lead in. You know, from a southpaw position, he almost like an upper 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 block. He knocks your arm up, and he's able to fire off that. There we saw him land the left hook. Right on the money, right to the chin. Bing! Bang! Yep. Huge overhand left. A quick reminder at the end of this fight, this end of our main event. If you want to keep watching, Pro Box TV app, download it now. Both judges, Enrico Lessini and Colin Burns, see the contest 97-92. All score for the winner, who is now the WBA Continental Super Featherweight Champion from Kazakhstan, Sultan Zorbe. Actually, closer than we expected, I guess, if you can say that. <laughs> yeah, two of those judges gave the Polish fighter three rounds. Three, three rounds. Oh, amazing. In Europe, they appreciate moving more. I guess so. In Florida, in Florida it would have been 190 across the board. Oh, yeah. definitely. Definitely. Remember, gentlemen, that was with a knockdown. Should but have, I should have fought in Europe one. <laughs> 139. <laughs> you would have been rewarded. Mm -hmm. Remember, download the Pro Box TV app. Three more fights to go. You've been watching us on FUBU. Thank you so much.